Welcome to Warriors TV in association with Novo Interiors. Tonight, the Warriors are taking on local rivals Billingham Stars in what is the fourth out of six scheduled matches between the two sides this season. This being the, the last game before Christmas, both sides will want to take some sort of advantage into a break with them. And uh, again, being a derby, it's always some fiery encounters between the two sides. Last week, it was a bit of a drab affair. Whitley skated out as 3 nothing winners, but uh, it was probably best forgotten. The overall uh, quality wasn't the best, but uh, we shall keep tight-lipped about that one. Sit back, relax, and enjoy these highlights. He's been there and done it all, I'd imagine. Oh, that took a wicked bounce off Emerson and went towards Brown in goal. Keeps it in for the Warriors, though, and Finlinson will send it off the boards. Helens will blast it clear off the boards. Only as far as Adam Wood, who kicks it towards Finlinson. And then attempted wrap around there by Greetans, who's eased away out the crease. So good, good defensive work by the Stars. This force is queening into the corner, away from the danger zone. Griggles collects with Helens going towards him. Griggles with a cut back, or oh, hit into the side net in oh. here. Yeah. Attempted wrap around by Queen, and he'll have to check back as uh, Brown was smart to that move. He's Some good work by Wood there, hustling down the boards, and yeah, he's going to have a dig here. Yeah, wound up a huge slap shot there, but drilled it straight into the pads of Tom Brown. That's oh. going to be a hooking call or tripping. No, Ooh. no call at all. But that looked like a trip to me. Uh, it was Emerson. as blatant as I've ever seen, I think. Yeah, Emerson was quite far away, and I mean, um, he certainly missed one there. He did. Billingham should have had uh, a power play off that. I'll be the first to admit that one. Griggles is with him. It's still interesting to see how they've got a Latvian defenceman playing in a forward position. That's not his, not his natural position, obviously. But they're short on numbers in forward Whitley this season as the shot almost came in from Queen and well defended by the Stars. Great save by Brown there. Um, Queen and put it the opposite way and he's moving. One on one here, tried to oh. deke him and he scores. And Queen and has opened the score in. One nothing Whitley. Yep. Nice pass there from the point. Queen and finds himself awake, has a space in front. And uh, he's just waited for the keeper to go down, took it away in the bottom corner. And uh, not much Brown could have done there. Good start and Queen and start as well this game. Yeah. Eased away, good defending by the Stars. Come away from the. A dangerous shooting position. Oh, a bit going on here. Yeah, it was almost like uh, Dr. Hook McCracken from Slapshot, that wasn't it? With the use of a stick, it was uh, the pair of them not letting that one go. Rigos doesn't mind banging, so the young one needs to be careful here. <laughs> well, that's right, we've seen him go toe to toe with Callum Watson, and not many people want to do that. And now they're, they're putting some shots in after the whistle on uh, Grigors, and he's got three or four Billingham players around him. It's been pretty scrappy early on, Dan, hasn't it? Yeah, most of the possession now in the star zone. Warriors being patient on the approach, cycling it around in the corners here. Yeah. Chalmers fires one in. Oh! oh! That was like a, goal, a cheeky golf chip, that wasn't it? Yeah. Bit of a knuckle ball from Chalmers from, from the blue line there. I think it took a deflection on the way through. Fluttered like a butterfly into the top corner, but uh, really it did be thrown. It was unsighted. And uh, the Warriors have taken any way they come, 2 0. Yeah, it was got that change of pace, I think, which wrong footed uh, Tom Brown, but I mean, one of the most uh, unorthodox finishes I think I've seen here. Queen and Gathers from uh, Grigors. Those two linking up well. Back with Grigors, will send it towards Dean Holland. Grigors will switch over to the right wing now. Tries to run wrong foot his man and then Holland kick save. save. Kick save by Brown. He'll cover it up with the mitt now, but great opportunity. It was getting away from Holland. Oh, and then he's uh, thrown a punch there, Dean Holland. He wasn't happy about something. Grigors is very quick to get in and uh, grab, grab uh, one of the Billingham players, but uh, I don't know what happened because it, it just seemed to spark out of nothing. I'm assuming something was said or maybe a late jab. Yeah, from it's num the number seven, Beef Dinner, who was uh, getting stuck in there again. I think that's the one that he wound up. He was, I think he was jabbing at him, but it's Lewis Hall who's uh, number 77 who, who had Grigors in a headlock there, but the two of them very quick to uh, pair off. But um, I don't think anything's been called in the end. It was either way, I think Brown had it covered. As, uh, they'll get a break on here at the Stars. But Adam Wood just using his body to get in between the man and the puck. Shielded it well, trying to get it clear. It won't get clear, but now Chalmers looking to break out the second attempt. 
play forward. This is nice. Open attacking hockey wrist and Chalmers scores! And he beats Thomas Brown like a rented mule and the Warriors will take a 3 up in lead. Yeah, good finish there. Brown won't get a piece of it, but it went through into the bottom corner. Chalmers with a great end coast to coast charge in there. Attack up with speed and put it in the bottom corner. Good finish to this first period, 3-0. Belt's dropped and it's the Warriors who come out with it. Holland gets it back to Hare. He's attempted pass out the zone, he's broken up. Crisp will gather, fires it in on goal. Well, just wider goal in the end. Hare will collect the rebound off Bowwater. And then he'll go again, we'll find Queen in on the right wing. He centres it towards Chalmers, who's uh, up from the back. In fact, he's being played as a forward again. I know it's Grigor's. In fact, they score! Dean Holland makes it 4 nothing. Yeah, with some good composure by Green Egg. Was it Grigor's there with the pass? Yeah, Grigor's, yeah. So Holland, who was coming sniping in on the high slot, and he put it away, took it away nicely. Low on the block side. Good finish by Holland, and he's been coming close for a while, and he gets himself on the score sheet. As uh, Woods... Uh, lined up a huge shot but it's coming back into play Galloway now gets it out to uh, the stars number 33 Braden and then there's a scrambling here the Warriors as Bo Water left his crease wouldn't get back up straight away but some good defensive work there and for as, uh, that one is gathered by the Warriors on the edge of a blue line it'll be carried in by Weverell and the shot by Fraser it didn't get too much power on the shot just allowed the goalie Hammond to uh, make the save and now Preston carrying it up the other end it's end-to-end -end stuff again here but Water couldn't hold on to that save it comes back out for Matty McDonald with crashed into Holland he, he could have done himself an injury himself so uh, just one of them unfortunate comings together but big hit coming in from Holland on one of the Billingham youngsters Holland's gone down he's looking for a penalty oh, there it's a breakaway here. Well, break away with uh, Johnson is it, gets the shot away, oh. lifted it out, Harry Hardy in front of him. Yeah, now uh, Stars will look to clear, try to play in Preston there, but Adam Wood was the first one back to clear it. Play forward to Finlandson, shot comes away, that's going to be gloved by the Billingham Stars goalie, Hammond. But, uh, yeah. Looks like he wants to go with her here, Sykes, let say a little bit of and it must be from playing on the same team. Maybe, yeah. Uh, I don't know if Dylan Hare would want to fight Chris Sykes. I mean, Sykes is actually quite a well-accomplished fighter, as it happens. So uh, I don't know if Dylan would want to uh, physically drop the gloves. It was probably some of the nothing. As uh, Hare will come across, attempted poke, check clearance. Sykes is away, though. He's trying to get in behind. Ah, well played. Well done, though, by oh, Dylan Hare. They're going to call he, a penalty, though. I think he played the puck there, to be fair. I thought, well, the puck definitely moved, so he, he had some connection on it. Whether he took the man first, I don't know, but it's going to be a penalty on Dylan Hare either way. Yeah, he was all well, done there. I mean, Sykes did have the, the, the step on him. And uh, Chris Sykes is certainly... Uh, words exchanged between him and Sean Kippen. Yeah, Kippen wants to Kippen go with him. Kippen wants a piece. I think he's there. Uh, Looking after his team again, Skippy, he's one of them lads. There's uh, Barnes, gets it back now to a point, fired in, save. Comes back to the Warriors again, and it's crept in on the near side. And I think it was, it was made by Dylan Hare, but he carried it forward, and it was definitely his, um, his movement forward which created that chance. Yeah, without a doubt, Dylan Hare stepping in well from the point. I think the stars player just got a hoop on his stick which knocked him off his stride and I think it was Kyle Ross who pounced on the on the rebound but uh, yep another goal for the Warriors 5-0 looking for another shot maybe from another win here yeah nice backhanded pass by Wood into the corner for Finlandson he will get there first with pressure coming in from behind he's got some space now he can get the shot away and he scores and uh, Finlandson makes it 6 up in then and uh, it was a goal all of his own making yeah, lovely finish by Finlinson there, got his head up, look where the, the net was open and just picked his spot really nicely. And uh, Hammond's looking a little bit upset there after such a good start. 6-0 uh, game, but a uh, great finish by Finlinson, you don't give him that type of space. No. Teammates in an offside position, he couldn't touch it because he'd be whistled, so... Cutting off the left wing. 
it's uh, Greetons, I think it was. And then he switches the play to Finlandson. And the cutback, Greetons gets it back and he finished. No. Oh. And now it's been crashed home by Sean Kippin. Slap me, silly Skippy. But, uh, I mean, it wasn't. Yep. That was all, all about the improvisation by Greetons once again on his knees. And he uh, read, read the movement of Kippin for the back post and put it on a plate for him. But it was a great assist there. And uh, exhibition stuff as we're coming to be uh, used to from Greetons. We wouldn't listen for a confirmation of that one. Well, we knew it was Kippen that got the goals. It should be three times with the assist. And it is. And Finlinson does get the secondary assist then. But yeah, it's, uh, it's really clicking and coming together nicely. It's been a relatively quiet game. By oh, that's in the back of the net by Johnson. And he gets one right from the edge of his own. But... Um, well, we barely had time to catch our breath from goal number seven, and Johnson gets number eight. Yeah, the shot was massive. Johnson, a great member of the team. Yeah, I mean, he, he missed a couple of games early in the season with work commitments, but it's, it's so good to see him back in the team because he's uh, he's an integral part of that defence. I think he, you know he's he's been in and around the team for a number of years now. He's he's no longer a rookie, and he's. Uh, I think he, he grows each year. He becomes a, a better and better player, and uh, you know he's. He's really chipped in with some important goals this season. Yep, good shot at the bottom corner. Finished it well. Patrick Strigors is going on the attack, trying to carry it in. Zor is looking to counter. There's three minutes, 22 to go. Greetans with the assist again. I was about to say before, Greetans had had a relatively quiet game by his high standards tonight, but he still ended up with a couple of assists there. And on his back in the slot, and Holland has gone in. It's number nine, so Dean Holland scratched my back with a hacksaw. Yeah, it's an absolute bonanza here. The goals right late in this third period. Uh, Holland getting on the, the goal sheet once again. And uh, yep, Warriors have put this game well and truly to bed. Well, it's a shame for the Stars because they'd, they'd played well, they'd battled hard all game, but it's last, um, well, it was goal number seven, wasn't it, which really broke them, as it were, and they've given up three quick goals now. Ryder chases it in, takes it into the corner. James Moss going to try to play back up and counter. And they're trying to test the goalie again, Jordan Barnes getting a shot away, and then there's some fist being thrown there by... Mile Ryder, I think it is, with one of the Stars players. And like, it's James Moss, isn't it? Like James Moss wants to go, but uh, Niall was ragged on in there a little bit. Yeah, I think they're keeping the, the looks for Christmas, them two. They didn't win quite into it there. And that will do it then, as uh, the Warriors with an emphatic win in the end, but um, really, well, the, the, the fans are chanting easy. It wasn't really. That's a, that's a bit harsh on the on the Stars players because actually I thought on the whole they give a good effort tonight. They certainly did, they came to play, uh, Warriors quality short through in the end with uh, some very quick goals towards the end of that third period which leaves a nine goal deficit which they didn't deserve tonight, they put up a good fight for much of that game but uh, it is what it is, it's a nine, nine goal victory for the Warriors and uh, they did deserve it tonight.